Let's take a look at the difference between the nitride, nitrite, and nitrate ion. This is something that gives people quite a bit of trouble. When we look at the nitride ion, that's going to be from nitrogen on the periodic table. So we have our N3 minus. For the nitrite and the nitrate, that's a little more difficult. So the way to remember these is memorize the nitrate ion. This one comes up quite frequently in chemistry. It'll save you a lot of time. Nitrate ion, NO3 minus. And then this rule here that when we have ite, ite is one less oxygen than eight. So we have NO3 minus, that's nitrate, ite's going to be one less. So instead of NO3 minus, we just have NO2 minus. And this works for all polyatomic ions. And we know that when we see something ending in ITE, like nitrite or sulfite, that's going to be a polyatomic ion. Same thing for ATE. If it's nitrate, phosphate, sulfate, polyatomic ion. And if you memorize the 8, you'll know what the ite is. It just has one less oxygen. These are all very different substances. We can see the nitride, that's just an ion, the 3 minus ionic charge. For the nitrite, we have this bent molecular geometry. And then for the nitrate, this is going to be trigonal planar. Very different geometry and different reactivity. So that's the difference between nitride, nitrite, and nitrate. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.